Bethel family. Welcome to Kid Connect. Was there no sound? <laughs> oh, oh, Kid Connect. I was like, man, you guys. I was trying to mess with people. Yeah. Well, you had that, you know, you were, you probably did mess with a bunch of people. Yes. They're like, oh no, what happened to my sound? But yes, welcome to Kid Connect. And today is a special day. If you're watching it on the day that it premiered. What is today, Pastor Anthony? Today, oh, the day it premieres. Yes, Not right now. Right, okay, exactly. it is February 14th, which, which is? is Christmas. No. Merry Christmas. It's not Christmas. Happy birthday to <laughs> you. Wait, that's no. not a Christmas. No, <laughs> and it's not Christmas. Oh. Happy Valentine's Day. Oh, Valentine's Day. It's the day. day of love. Love. It is. I love I, you, Miss Christmas. I love you too. We're married. We are. That is true. And I love you. I love you too. And happy Valentine's Day to everyone out there who's watching. Hopefully you've got some candy or something to enjoy today. <laughs> oh, at the very end of this, Gordon wants to play. Our dog wants to play. Um, at the very end of this, maybe we could show them what I made for you. Oh yeah. That'd be okay. Cool. Yeah. So. Look Stay out. tuned. All right. So what? Are, wait. Did you ask a question? Uh, no. Okay. So what are we learning today? <laughs> well, we are continuing with our month of love, and today I thought it would only be appropriate if we talked about the love chapter in the Bible. Do you know what the love chapter is? It's First Corinthians thirteen. I was just always testing. You thought him. I was going to mess with you. I'm always testing him, aren't I? But yes, it's First Corinthians thirteen, and it talks about <laughs> love and what love is. So first. I want to go over what it says about what it what it isn't, okay? All or right, or let's do if it. you didn't have love, okay? So it says if I could speak all the languages of earth I and can't. of angels, I can't, which I cannot either, but didn't love others. I mean, that's pretty cool if you could speak all those languages, but you if you did all that and you didn't love others, you would only be a noisy gong or a clanging cymbal. That's kind of not fun, it's right? It's like Gordon squeaking <laughs> that ball. Like, yeah. So it's saying, even if I knew all the languages in the world, yes, that's pretty impressive. That is pretty impressive. And yes. and angels. And of the angels, yes. Which is pretty impressive. Yes. I would just sound like a little dog running around, distracting everybody mm -hmm. with a squeak ball. If you didn't have love, that's correct. If I didn't have love. Yes. Okay, what else? Yeah. And if I had the gift of prophecy, and if I understood all of God's secret plans, and possess all knowledge. And if I had such faith that I could move mountains, but didn't love others, I would be nothing. Like a small dog. Nothing. Squeaking its ball. Yeah. Is that what you're I mean, saying? That's pretty amazing stuff. All God's secret plans, all of his knowledge, faith that you can move mountains. That's how important it is to love? Yeah. Isn't that amazing? Even our enemies? Oh, yeah, we talked about that last Hashtag week. last, well, I'll go back and watch last week. <laughs> Hashtag something else. <laughs> yeah. Lesson from last week. Last week, Kid Connect. Hashtag Kid Connect. <laughs> there you go. I did it. I got there. I'm cool. <laughs> you finally got there. Good job. <laughs> and the last one it says, if I gave everything I had to the poor and even sacrificed my body, I could boast about it. But if I didn't love others, I would have gained nothing. Man. So doing works, good works is amazing if you do good things for other people is such a good thing but if you do it without love it doesn't really mean anything so love is an important piece of the puzzle love is that what you're saying is, yeah god said it even if i'm the most amazing person who does the most amazing things yep. even if i could fly around like superman yes and save the entire <laughs> world it wouldn't mean anything. But I had it. no love in my heart and yeah. I didn't love others and love God. Then I'm nothing. Yep. It's harsh, right? Oh, man. But it's the truth. So, okay, I have a little object lesson. You know, what's this? I think everybody knows what this is. It's a phone. It's a telecommunication device. Yes. Now, who, have, who gets scared when they see that little battery thing go to red? I know our kids on their tablets are like, oh, no. It's low battery. I gotta plug it in. Because they know that if the battery runs out, it's useless, right? Does it work when it has no battery? 
No. So it's just like, this is an amazing device, but if it doesn't have a battery, it's useless. And that's like, if we do all of these things for God and we all, we do all these things for other people, but we do it without love, it doesn't mean anything. It's empty. Yes. Well, so we talked about what we are without love. Yes. So can we, should we talk about the rest of that chapter? It actually says what love exactly. is. Exactly. Yes. So, so let's get to the exciting part. What I'm is gonna, love? I'm going to grab mine so I can read it. Because <laughs> last week, I don't know if you noticed, but Miss Kristen, she wrote out it, but then she's moving it like this and no, like this. And I'm like, upset. how am I supposed to? I mean, I know I can speak every language in yes. the entire universe. No, I can't. <laughs> um, but, I, you know, I can't read something that's going around like it's I orbiting it me. Slightly. Or were you just saying slightly. that I have a gravitational pull, that I, things orbit around me? Is that what you're saying? Sure. Sure. Well, that's not kind. <laughs> what? You're saying that I'm large enough as a no, planet no, or the I, sun. That's not what I said. I know that I've had too many <laughs> sweets lately, but Miss Kristen, that is not kind. That is All right. not what I said. <laughs> and let me tell you, do you know what love is? <laughs> First Corinthians Let's 14, hear. verse 4. Love 13, is patient. 13. 13. What'd I say? 14. I'm thinking the 14. <laughs> First Corinthians 13, <laughs> verse 4. Yes. Pastor Anthony is really tired. <laughs> love is patient. See, please be patient, patient with yes. me. Yeah. Um, and kind. Mm -hmm. Love kind. Be kind, yes. Be kind. I did Doesn't not say have a gravitational any, force. I not say anything unkind. Love is me. not jealous or boastful or proud or rude. It does not demand its own way. Uh, it is not irritable and it keeps no... Man, these are convicting. These yeah. are not easy <laughs> no, things. they're not. Right, boys and girls? Do these sound easy? Um, love, it, it's not irritable. It keeps no record of being wronged. So that means like not holding a grudge. That means Ooh. when your when your brother like punches you and then they say they're sorry, you have to be like, I forgive you and I'm gonna Forget erase it. it from my memory. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Really scrubbed there. Yep. That <laughs> it's hurt. It's gone. It's gone. Um, <laughs> and it's red. No. <laughs> uh, it does not rejoice about injustice, but rejoices when the truth wins out. Love never gives up. Never give up. Never struck up. Love never gives up, never loses faith, is always hopeful, and endures through every circumstance. That's a lot there. I mean, that's where you wanted me, right? Yes. Okay. Like that, love is way more than just a, a simple word. It is amazing. I know. What love is. It even puts up with things when someone random yells something random, like, Gordon, stop. <laughs> See? <laughs> Do you still love me? I do. Thank yeah, you. Even I when do. you yell random stuff. Our yeah. dog's name is Gordon. Right now, he has decided as soon as we hit record, he's going to run around, squeak things, and then try to eat the couch. <laughs> Why? We don't know. But I guess we have to love him, don't we? Yes, we do love Because him. we'll be yes. patient and kind, yes. and please don't eat our couch. <laughs> he's not eating the couch. He is like trying to go under it. I think he has a donut. His toy donut. <laughs> not yes, a real, not donut. A real donut. We don't feed the dogs real donuts. <laughs> yes, that's right. All right, so yeah, love is way more than any of us really, I think, give it credit, give it credit for. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's yeah. it's way more in depth. There's so much forgiveness. And then we look at this, and when God says he loves us, there's so much more in that right. than what we realize. That's very true. You know what I was noticing from this? A lot of it is the fruit of the Spirit. Yeah. You know, a lot of what love is, fruit of the Spirit, is in there. Which, I, it just, we always come back to the fruit of the Spirit. I know. That's what But it's out. so important. It is. It's so important, all of that and how it wraps up. And, and it's it's the basis, it's the meaning of life. Yeah. It is what life yeah. is about. You know, God is telling us, if you don't have love, you have Nothing. 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 That's big. There's nothing. And then you're like, well, I love my family, but that's not what love is according to God. Love is loving everybody, loving yeah. everyone, having pay, be, being patient and kind. Not demanding your own way. Not holding Ooh. grudges, you know, being faithful, mm -hmm. you know, like these are not necessarily easy things. And in, in a world where we're kind of taught, especially here in America, where you do you, you do what makes you happy. The, the, the Bible's version of what love is, is the exact opposite. Yeah. It's be there for God and be there for those around you. Yeah. You know, that those are the two most important things. Um, and there's a lot of self-sacrifice. Yes. And so it's challenging. But that, so when you think about 
Valentine's Day today, think about all that love really is, mm -hmm. which is everything we've been talking about for like a month and a half. Yeah. It's all that stuff. <laughs> love and is we could big. talk we could probably <laughs> talk every week for a year just figuring out what love is. Yeah. Because it's way more than what we've been taught through movies and right. and hashtags. Right? Isn't that how you do the hashtag? <laughs> Don't ask me. <laughs> or like this, or <laughs> don't do something you you. Oh, it can mean something bad. I don't know. I don't know. I case. I've seen people do. <laughs> can I draw it? Yes. It's like that. That's yes. a hashtag. Okay. Yes. <laughs> um. <laughs> All right. Uh, Am I praying? Sure. You're right. praying. Lord, thank you so much for this day. We love you. We give you praise. We thank you for loving us, and just pray that you help us to understand all that that means. Um, and just continue to challenge us every day with, uh, with your heart and, and, and what it means to love you and to love others. God, we just thank you. We love you. We give you honor and glory. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Do you want me to go get the present that oh, you yes, made? Oh, yes, and I'll give, I'll give the Day. stuff. Yes. So every uh, we've got little family devotions that you can do throughout the week. Just check out GoBethelChurch.com. Uh, so kids, ask your parents. Say, I want to do the devotion tonight. Um, I want to have devotions to learn about you. You can do that. Uh, you can also go on the Facebook page. It's all on there. Go Everything is Go Bethel Church um, for Facebook. Uh, if you want to go directly to the kids one, it's Go Bethel facebook.com forward slash go Bethel kids. You could check out the little devotions we have there every night and questions and a little video. It's fun. Um, uh, and then, oh, for all the other information at the church, go Bethelchurch.com. There's some big announcements. Yeah. Like we're going to be meeting in person Yay. March 7th. Seven. Yes, there you go. Seven. It doesn't matter, does it? <laughs> no, no. March 7th. Uh, you know, check out all the information on that. And then at first, there'll be everyone inside, kind of together yeah. inside. Oh, yeah, we're still on church and yeah. lawn. Um, but inside, March 7th. And, uh, you know, there's a whole bunch of information with that. So go go about the church .com. Um, You know, so kids, tell your parents. Parents, if you're watching, go check it out. Okay, do you want to show them yes, before we go? See what, this is what Pastor Anthony made me for Valentine's Day. Are you ready? Whoa. Whoa. Look at look that. Look at that. I made it is that. 3D printed. How cool is that? Learning a new skill. Ooh. Oh, that is very cool. Yeah, Thank look you. Look at the inside too. I know. It actually it's so like, cool. Ooh. <laughs> All right. Now we dance off. Oh. <laughs> we dance off.